Assalamu alaikum. What is Inam Dikanu still doing in the DSF's custody? An order has been given from the court to the government that Inam Dikanu should be returned back to Kenya and he should be compensated with a sum of 500 million naira, but he is still in their custody. Why? Why, 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 why? Has Nigeria gotten to a level that we don't have laws any longer? We don't abide by the rules and regulations given to us? If we are to break these rules, oh, what a pity to us. But now, it's for the government to do what is right, but they are not. Instead, discrimination, tribalism, ethnicity has become the order of the day for them. And I don't know what they are putting in the minds of the Southeast and the Northerners. Because we, the Northerners, are the ones being affected. Why? Because the people ruling us are from the North. I blend them. See, there is no way I will blend the Southeast if they think of having their own nation with the way things are going, with the way our governments are taking things. In on serious. Let me say it that way. If you are making us look at, look, I, I never for once loved the Southeast. The only thing I had for them then was hatred, but I came to realize that this is not how it's supposed to be. Then let the government do what is right. If an order has been given, a order is an order. Let's abide, let's go by that order. Not bringing in uh, discrimination, bringing our tribalism into our mind. Oh, come on. That is not what we are out for. And that is why we will keep fighting till what we are looking for is achieved. Please, this man should be returned back to Kenya because he was, he was kidnapped to this place. If I was being kidnapped, I would not be happy about it too. Let me be realistic and let me be sincere about it. Please, my viewers, share this video. Let it go 